guys. So I am beyond ecstatic. I have a Lush haul. And oh, I don't have a Lush in my area. The closest Lush to me is two and a half hours away. Um, I didn't have a Lush near me when I was in Europe. That one was like two hours away. I haven't been in a Lush store in a really long time. And so I went berserk in there and I'm just stayed and enjoyed myself and just tried all the new things and oh I had so much fun so I just want to share with you guys what I got and some of this stuff's really cute like this one is called candy fluff and it's a dusting powder and it looks like this and I think it's such a cool idea so you open it up and it kind of just like sprinkles out like this it's a little bit messy so I won't like go crazy with it but you like rub it into your skin and um, it has a little bit of glitter to it it smells Similar to, um, what is it? I can't, oh, Snow Fairy. And um, has multi purposes. Now, when the lady, oh, when the lady um, demonstrated it to me, she put it in your hands and you put it on your skin. It kind of gives you that, like, white, like, little, not like residue, but like, looks like your skin's dry. So, what I did was I put on, like, some lotion. Like, put on your body lotion for your you're all over like when you get out of the shower or something let it sink in for a few minutes and then put this on um and you just put it on your hands and then rub it into your skin and it leaves like just like a little bit of like glitter and then it smells like snowberry and uh another use for this is kind of like dry shampoo or baby powder so when you haven't washed your hair your hair is like this second day and it's a little bit oily you rub it into your hair and um it'll take away some of that like oiliness look so you don't have to like have like greasy looking hair and I thought that was really cool too so this is a huge hit I love that and uh, something else that I got to throw in my bag is the helping hands hand lotion and really really good packaging it has a little pump and you just you know pump it out and it comes out in like very small amounts because it's, it's really like rich uh, ingredients so you just need a little a bit and then you rub it into your cuticles and your hands and um, it has a lot of really amazing things in here I, I read like a little write up on their in their newspaper thing that they have and um, some of the things that I really liked was the um, seed butter and honey and it has shea butter and sweet almonds and it has a um, really really soothing smell to it so I really, really like, I think this is a really good purchase if you're interested in, like, a hand cream that's just, like, a pump. You don't have to, like, get all messy or anything like that. And it's not oily at all. Um, I got the Grease Lightning Tea Tree Cleanser. And this, um, it's basically supposed to help with, um, acne. If you need, like, a spot treatment or something. Like I said, I had a breakout or something. Um, this broke me out. So I've been using this as a spot treatment. And I can't really say at this point if I think it works or not. So I won't. But this is something I've been trying out. Something that I love from them is their lip scrub. And I got the mint juleps. Which smells like peppermint. It has a little tingle on it. It looks like this. Um, I use it for my dry lips. You just need a little bit and then you kind of just like rub your lips together. And um, ah, I'm excited about that too. I picked up a um, soap, the Godmother. I'm not going to open it. I'm pretty, I, I mean here's like a little, it's like the purple thing. It's supposed to be like Snowberry. I have another piece of this at home that I've been saving and holding on to because it's the only Lush thing that I have in my house. And I didn't want to use it, but now that I have this, I can use the other. I don't know, I'm weird like that. Okay, this is their new bath bomb. It's like Space Girl or UFO Girl or something like that. It was named after after a song. It's got glitter on it. Oh my gosh. The smell is beyond amazing. Like beyond amazing. I don't really even have the description or anything like that. I'll put in an annotation so you guys have what the site says it's supposed to smell like versus what, what I don't even know what I would say it smells like I'm not very good at that kind of stuff 
Um, this is the Think Pink Balm. It doesn't have as strong as a smell as the uh, the other one I just showed you, the UFO or Space Girl or whatever. It just smells clean. I also got a bubble, like a bubble bar one. It looks like it's like something floating. Not cup I thought it would be like cupcake something. It looks like like floating island. I think that's what it is. Oh, I just got it on my lip. <laughs> it smells really good. I like that one. I got one last one. I'm going to go back. Oh, this is heavy. Oh, there's two in here. That's why. And uh, tomorrow I have a, a spa appointment, and I'm going to go get some more stuff, I think. This is Avo, like uh, A-V-O. And it doesn't smell like super good. It doesn't smell bad at all, but it has like avocado. It's supposed to be really like rich and nurturing for your skin. That's why I got it. But the other one in here, I don't even know. I think I just threw it in a bag. My basket. Yeah, I don't even know what this is. It's just big and it's green and it has lush on it. I'll put, I'll annotate what the magazine says that it is if it's in there. But yeah, that's everything I got at Lush. I know this is really, really quick. Probably, if I had to say, my favorite bath bomb I got would be the new, like, one with the glitter that looks like this. Um, and that's just for smell. Uh, for use, I don't know. I haven't used any of them yet, so I don't know which one's going to, like, be the best. Um, and then the, like, the best um, thing I think that's, like, the cool, I don't know, the, I guess the coolest thing I think I got is the candy fluff. I think that's super cute. So, yeah, that's all the stuff I got from Lush. I'm really excited. I hope you guys enjoyed that. Um, gee, I think everyone should try out the candy fluff. That's just my opinion, though. And, um, yeah. Uh, oh, do you guys want to see what I got from Lululemon? Should I add that on here? I think I'm going to. Hold on. So, oh, I went to Lululemon, and, oh my goodness, it was just crazy in there. This is the bag they gave me. It's kind of big. I don't have all Lululemon stuff in here, but this is still the bag that I got from them for purchasing what I got. Um, oh, I'm really, I am really stressed out by, like, my hair is, I know I'm playing with it too much. Like, stores that have, like, tons of people, and there was a line to the door just to try on clothes. No joke. Like, I think I waited, because I don't, I don't have anything with lemon, so I didn't know what size they were, so I wanted to try it on before I made any kind of purchase from there, because I don't have a way of returning it, because again, my area doesn't have a Lululemon. So, I waited 20 odd minutes just to try on clothes. Like, now I've always had to wear two or three sports bras. That sounds crazy, but I, that, it's a true story. And when you do that, it makes you look super flat and, like, like, oh, it's not, like, suffocating, but it, like, presses you in. And so it makes working out and going to the gym just a bummer because it's aggravating. Well, and in, in any case, I, um, I don't know what the name of this one is called, but the Tata Tamer. It's a 32D specific size sports bra. And it has the three clasps in the back, and if it's, like, a bra and it fits like it actually fits i have that fluff stuff on it from blush kind of funny but anyways it looks like this it has like removable pad that those things are like removable um i was just amazed i was like in the dressing room like jumping up and down and it didn't hurt and they weren't moving and they weren't like like stuck to me either so um, I'm in love, and I, I know that's pretty for anyways, uh, I ended up being a size 4, so I got some little, like, shorts, they're just, like, little shorts, they have, like, little thing in the back, they're really plain, but they, they feel comfortable, and then I got, which is why the bag's probably so big, one of their hoodies, because I really, really liked how, when you zip it up, it goes to here, and then it covers here, like, you know, your head or whatever, and I just got the plain black one. Okay, so I went to American Eagle, 
and hopefully you guys go there too because um it's buy one pair of the shorts get the second pair half off i got this kind of like wash i don't know that i got these so i liked the buy one get one half off thing okay last thing i'll show you i went to lash a toe and this was on sale and they have the one they have them in black on sale too and um it's this little chained um like round purse like little tassel thing and it may not be for everyone but i think it's adorable hope you guys enjoyed it and i'll talk to you next time